Good morning, Mink and Milk and Wild Mike. How you guys doing today? Yeah, we're going back to the volcano. We're going to try to make it into the heart of it today. We'll see how it goes, though. <laughs> Our first trip to the volcano wasn't too good. <laughs> well, such is the life of a solo player. You're going to get beat up once in a while, I guess. Let's see, what do we have on us here? Guess we should grab some more. Uh, you know what? I think we're out of aloe. We're gonna have to go. We're gonna go harvest some more aloe plants. Yeah, we've only got eleven. We'll go make up some more aloe aloe potions before we head in there. Satan's gamer, how you doing? Oh, wild Mike, that sucks. Yeah, seems like uh, one person brings lice in the school and a lot of kids get it. Kind of kind of sucks too, you got to wash everything, and use that Nix or whatever to get rid of them. This makes a big hassle for everybody. Uh, let's see, we put some of our thralls in here that we got from the volcano. We got a Delencia, we got Haas the Venomous, Lesterette, we got from the Purge, TMA, and another Kissless. Let's take Lesterette out for a little ride. And we'll run around with him today. Oh, he's got a nice little obsidian shield and mace. What's he got for stats? 15 strength, 30 vitality. 60% chance in growing in strength, 65 in vitality. We can up his strength with some gruel. We'll make a good fighter out of him. Mink and Milk, uh, run to the unnamed city. Robert Stewart, good morning, how you doing? Uh, Mink and run to the unnamed city. There's a couple of spots where it's real easy to just run in and grab some fragments. Actually, remind me before we end the stream, and we'll take a quick run through there, and I'll show you where they are. Yeah, Wild Mike, you can kill bosses for them, too, but there are, there's like three or four boxes that you can just run by and collect without doing too much climbing. Uh, you can usually just zip right by, grab the box, and get out of there before all the skeletons or ads are on you. Uh, let's see, we need... A little bit of this. Let's do 70 plant fiber. We'll make some gruel for our new buddy here. And what do we have for armor? Not a whole lot. Let's make up some heavy padding here. See, we have one, so we only need four of those. Yeah, Wild Mike, there is a, uh, there's an interactive map for Conan Exiles that you can look up. Shows you all the locations of everything you want to know on the map, actually. Uh, let's see. Put our Yogg's touch back there. Uh, what do we want to go with Lester at here? Or we should make a set of Redeemed Silent Legion. What do we need? We need a little star metal. We need some black ice. I think we have all of that still. take 200 of it. I gotta get up and get some more black ice real soon here. Star metal, ooh, we only have 40. We need to go get some star metal too. So we'll leave the black ice there. Guess we'll go do a little uh, star metal hunting. Uh, 
Yeah, Wild Mike, that, that one's kind of hard to see at times because it's only like the tip of a corner that sticks out of the sand there. If you know where to find it, it's easy to find, but if you're not sure where to find it, it can be, it'd be a little rough finding it. Let's, you know what, we're going to leave him with his mace for now. No more heels hidden in here. You know what I think we're going to make instead? Let's make some more dragon bone armor. Just because I love the looks of it. We'll put that on old Lester right here. Uh, let's go with... Uh, Void Forge version. Oh, we need the medium for that. Never mind. We're going with we're going with this one. We'll put this on all Lester at here. Oh, Lester. Lesterette, Listermine, whatever you want to call them. Here you go, guy. You're going to look all tough and badass now. A couple little shout outs to do this morning to uh, Kalia and Mason and even the other Mason we said hi to yesterday. A couple, uh, couple new young ones to the to the club here. <laughs> Mink and milk, yeah, it's, uh, you learn the game as you go on. I still don't know everything about the game. I've been playing it for almost three years now and still learn stuff. Yeah, Robert, those, uh, all of the, uh, legendary drops in the chests are just RNG spawns. It's all random, and you, just, you never know what you're going to get. I think we should probably fix up a few of our tools. I don't think we've... No, we haven't used that one since the last time I was farming. Which I haven't been out farming in a while. i got to get busy on that. Uh, let's see, I think I have some explosive arrows over here somewhere. Those are ivory. There we go. Take some explosive arrows. Got a couple of pickaxes. Let's go see if we can find a little bit of uh, a little bit of star metal. <laughs> Minkin asking total noob questions. Hey, you know what? You got to start somewhere, right? That's the way I see it. We weren't all born knowing how to play this game. So you gotta, easiest way to learn it is to ask. Ah, Rico, nice, nice, the warden perk, that's a good one. Is, uh, wax server still PVE? I think we'll do this, we'll finish up this series, we'll move over to SIPTA for a while, and then I think I'll go into a, uh, go in and have a little bit of PvP fun on a server somewhere. Let's see, do we have any smoking nodes anywhere visible yet? Once in a while you'll find them down here in the valley. Lestrat, why you gotta beat up the poor goats? Hey, you know, Minkin, when I was younger, back in my, like, grade school days, a teacher once told me the only stupid question is one that you don't ask. Well, I think I drove that teacher nuts asking her all kinds of questions every single day. <laughs> Rico, the warden perk is the uh, 
The accuracy one, I thought that one was the plus three to everything, like, uh, oh, what, you know what perk I'm talking about, Rico. Oh, come on, why does this keep throwing me off? Rico, you're, you're the one that always, uh, seems to know what I'm trying to talk about when my CRS kicks in. <laughs> Where'd I get Lester at, Mark? Uh... Dogger Cat had a uh, purge up at his base by the Frost Giant Temple there. We got uh, five or six named purge thralls out of there. So I took Lesterette. Uh, everybody else got what they want, I hope. So yeah, he's, he's a purge thrall. Uh, pretty comparable to Orvar Battleborn. The other named Purge uh, Berserker Thrall from the Purge. Plus three, Universal Warrior. That's right. See, I knew you'd know what I was thinking of there, Rico. These guys just aren't going to leave me alone, are they? Now they are. So unfortunately, I'm not seeing any star metal up here. I have to, oh, here we go, right here. Look at that. Got another PIA goat here. Go away, buddy. Thank you. Yeah, Minkin, when my teacher told me there's no, the only stupid question is a question you don't ask, well, I think I drove her up the wall asking questions after that. I mean, that, that was like a free pass for her. How come? Why? You know, those kind of questions. All right, cracked it open on the first shot. Nice. Let's give us a little bit of star metal. We'll make up a uh, redeemed Silent Legion set here sometime today too. Yeah, he uh, doesn't actually start out the best with like strength. Once we give him Gruel, his growth percent chance will go to 74% instead of the 60 for the strength. So we'll get his strength build up for a little bit, and then eventually we'll switch over to like Grilled Steaks, something like that. I know it's it'll only give him like another 14% chance in uh, Vitality, but Grilled Steak, I mean, you get that anywhere and everywhere. I think it's, is it the, not the lasting meal, the other meal gives them like 16% growth chance. This is going to be a rough one to get here, but we're going to try it. Because what would a rotten stream be without a bunch of rotten deaths? Another one cracked open on the first try. I hate wasting arrows on these when you... Shoot them three or four times before they crack open. No, 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 don't fall off. That's right, Patty. Good morning. How you doing? We're going to stand on this burning rock here, harvest it, and hopefully not fall to our death. I'm going to collect a little bit of star metal here so we can make a, re a set of redeemed Silent Legion later. I don't know if I have enough uh, hardened leather for that yet. Might as well go over here and check out Stargazer's Crest. Oh, look at all this iron ore, man. I am running out of iron quick. Need to do another, uh, need to get on later and do some more farming. Still sick, Patty? That sucks. My daughter just got a hold of me today, and she hasn't been feeling too good, so she went and took the test, and she's got the big C now. So she's feeling pretty rough, but... She should, uh, should be okay. She's pretty tough. She had to grow up with three older brothers that used to pick on her and beat her up all the time, so she'll be fine. 
We'll take your steel, thank you. What you got? A little more steel. We'll take these and grind them up. We'll take the brimstone because we haven't gone down and got any yet. Starting to get pretty low on steel fire to make more steel. The predatory blade mark? No, we have not gotten that yet. Been uh, kind of busy, uh, you know, dying in the volcano the last couple days. <laughs> I want to get back to the city though and fight the brute, try to get the predatory blade. Let's uh, eat a little food here. Should have grabbed some more black ice while we were up there. That was kind of dumb to forget about that. Well, this will give us a start on some of our uh, star metal bars, though. Uh, let's see. We'll take this out of there for now. We'll throw this in there. And... Uh, let's see where to go. There we go. We'll throw that in there. Oh, we don't have enough room. Fine. Throw that in there. I think we have a little bit of brimstone left over here. <laughs> Seven more. Very little brimstone. I'll throw the steel fire back in here for now, too. Not wrong one. Really need to break this furnace down and change it with a, a better one. Not enough room and inventory. Fine. We'll do it like that then. I'll throw these nodes over here for now. Black ice. I think I need the black ice for the redeemed legion too. So we're gonna have to go get some more of that. Yeah. Need like almost 20 for each piece. 17, 12, 12. Did I take the black ice out of here yet? Yeah, I did. Danny Gage, thank you so much for the subscription. Uh, I thought I picked up some of the black ice out of here. I did not. It'll be one of those days. Man, I think that's all we have for brimstone, too. So we'll go down, we'll get some aloe, we'll stop in, grab some brimstone. Come back up here. Make another set of armor, then we'll go... Well, wrong box. Then we'll go play in the, uh... Go we'll play in the uh, volcano a little more. Let's see, we got some antidotes, got some poison for our weapon. Get rid of this other star metal. Because the stuff's heavy and we don't need to carry it around all day. Steel, we can put that away. These we're going to throw right in the dismantler. There. Just like that. Come on, Lester, let's get you some gruel. Lester, you coming? Now the neighbor's out here to play with. Got on here last night for a little bit, farmed up a little bit more stone. I've got a ton of uh, stone consolidant made up. Well, not a ton, but I got a nice little bit of it made up. But I do need to get some more stone. Some, I think I'm out of hardened brick now. <gasps> Running out of everything, guys. But I uh, kind of finished off these... Not that you can really see them right now. I kind of finished off the little towers back here. Timothy Bootwell, thank you so much for subscribing. I did a little more work on these. The other day I think we put the roof on our little bridge there. Still not sure what I want to do in this open area. Kind of don't want to build up 
right next to this area. I'd like to keep this area open a little bit. I don't know. I'll figure something out with it. And then inside I just put some stairwells going up. A couple lights here and there. Those are the watcher lights which were twitch drops. I think there's a door around here somewhere. Did I put a door in here? Maybe I didn't. I swear I had a door over here. Oh, you know what? That's down here on this level. There's our door. Here's our little bridge coming through to the other tower. Nothing big, nothing fancy yet. I don't know what I'll actually do with this area. Just more empty rooms that I've built. Then I think I'm going to have to move this door because it's right underneath the door step or the stairs. But it works. Put some big wheels of paint up there. Uh, let's see, they're four by four wide. Two small wheels of paint. One on each tower would probably fit fine. Hello, Scotty, get your own. How you doing today? So yeah, let's uh let's run down to by the Sepamaru area. Get a little bit of aloe. Maybe take a look through Sepamaru. Oh man, I did it again. Oh no, I went to the right one. I thought I went to the city again. <laughs> Oh, on the floors? Yeah, I could do that too, Mike. I've got one of the the middle uh, wheels of pain in the base already. I might might put another one out uh, when I really get into thrall hunting. We'll we'll see how it goes. And when update 2.7 comes live, it'll no longer rain inside your bases in the jungle or up north. <laughs> yeah, wild Mike. You don't have to worry about that. If they don't learn it here, they'll learn it in school, right? <laughs> Yeah, yeah, yeah. Angry turtles. Just here to get your, uh, just here to take some of your aloe, buddy. You know what, Lester? Take care of that guy, will you? You're not doing too good there, Lester. You actually got to hit him. There you go. Let's see. Oh, that's not aloe. Come over here, we'll steal this guy's aloe plants. Ouch, quit hitting me. Let's see, that should be plenty good on aloe for now. Will you guys, like, just go away? Well, they grab the last couple aloe plants while we're here. Uh, 2.7 is out on test live right now. It's usually usually like a minimum of two weeks lead time before it comes to the live uh, branch. I mean, don't don't take that as the whole truth and nothing but the truth, because really, who knows? But it's usually at least two weeks that it stays on test live before it goes live. What do the other lotus lotus potions do? Uh, see, like the the gray lotus, I believe. I don't know Rico might answer that better, because I'm just gonna I'm gonna say the wrong thing. <laughs> Dogger cat, didn't see you sneaking in there. How you doing today, buddy? 
Uh, the, the different Lotus Potions give you different attribute bonuses. But they usually make you kind of drunk or tipsy or something to that effect. Where'd you go, Lester? At? I gotta change your uh, change your behavior. You're gonna pick fights with everybody in here, aren't you? Okay, now you got them mad at me too. Ow. Why you guys gotta be shooting me? I'm not the one that started the fight here. Lesterette's working on getting me killed today. Nice guy, huh? To the still run away, little turtle, run. Things are not good here. Lesterette, come here. Get back here. Oh, we killed the little baby shale back too. All right, Lesterette. Let's put you on guard me and then, you know, chill out a little. Eric, how you doing today? Smelter two, nah. Hey, anybody who needs a uh, day of lead drinker, she's over here in the city. Oh, and we're gonna die 100 arrow, you know what? We just might have to knock him on the head a couple times here. Here, you take that, and I left Love Tap at home, didn't I? Or no, I think our other thrall's carrying Love Tap. Or eat some bees. I have like tons of honey already that we don't need. And do we have another truncheon? No, we do not. <laughs> Tasty civilian casualties. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh, let's see. You know what, Lester? At? Just start knocking them both out. I'll go over here and watch for a little bit. There you go. You actually got to hit him, Lester. At. You got to hit him. Yeah, boxy balls. <laughs> Doggo, you got the evil twin up there, huh? Nice. Yeah, stop by and check out your place, Doggo. You said you got it lit up like a Christmas tree, huh? Buster at, you doing alright over there? I think you're bleeding a little bit, a little crippled. Why don't you use your shield? You got it in your hand. How are we doing with the people here? Yeah, you got Dea half knocked out. Gundai, she's not doing too good with her. No, you don't. Oh, wrong person. Lester, I'm going to have to take your uh, truncheon away from you and do this myself. If I can get to him, I'll take his uh, shield away from him. I'll just stand shield while he clubs him. Yeah, you got one of them knocked out anyways. Where's uh, Mandu guy at? Yeah, almost halfway knocked out. Yeah. 
Lester, I could have done this a long time ago. He's not doing too good knocking people out yet. Doing alright though. Level 3. Now oh, we're taking hits. Knock her out. Come on. Knock her out. Now you put your shield down just so she can poke you a few times. Your death will be as meaningless as your life. Set the glory in your death. I guess I really should have brought another truncheon with me. It's gonna take a while. This will be the whole stream today, watching Les Strat knock people out. Alright, get her down to 20%. Couple more hits, she'll go to sleep. I think Lestret's chewing through his food pretty good. I will cut your heart out. Come on, a couple more hits. You got her knocked out. Like the Cobra exile, my fight is death. There you go, just hit her. Just whack her in the head once. There you go. Alright, let me give you your weapon back. You kind of suck with the truncheon. <laughs> I will take my gun die back to our base. I will throw her on the wheel over here for now. We'll eventually take her back up to our base. Eventually, I want to make some boxes so that when we get purged, we can lead the uh, purge people into them. Not that it works out like that anymore. Purges spawn all kinds of goofy places up, up north. I'd like to have a couple of boxes to lead them into, shut a gate behind them, and then have air, uh, archers just shooting the... Uh, uh, concussion arrows at them. Oh, that's right. I forgot all about all this stuff we had here. So we don't have to go and harvest any more brimstone. We just ran out of weight last time we were down here. We'll take this. Yeah, nice. What we have in here? Look at that. We even have some gruel left over in here. Get her all trained up. Might even take a baby shale back home with us. Why? I don't know. Why not? <laughs> so day of lead drinkers laying over there in the uh, unnamed city at the northwest entrance if anybody wants her. She's already knocked out over there. Wife is on uh, Thanksgiving break now. Hopefully I can, like, haul her upstairs and get a new cup of coffee. <laughs> we'll see. We'll see how that works. <laughs> Trying to make her feel sorry for me and bring me a cup of coffee every now and then. Yeah, I'm with you, Wild Mike. The uh, pets are a little bit squishy. If you could actually equip them with armor or something, that, that would be a hell of a big improvement to them. Yeah, we'll take all that. Why not? Come on, Lesterette, let's go. Yeah, if you could actually equip 
armor on a pet and maybe boost up their uh, vitality a little bit, it would probably be more useful. Although the Greater Wolf and the Greater Sabertooth make uh, pretty good pets. Coffee feelings, yes. Coffee feelings. I like that, Rico. Uh, go get that guy. He's gonna come over here and whack me with the sword. You gonna take him out? Alright, Lester, I'll do the work. Now you all crippled. Keep more gruel. Might have to give Lester at the uh, Telesoro sword. See if he does any better with that. I think we put a upgrade kit on it. Patty, your greater pet bugs out, huh? All right, let's make some more concentrated aloe. 20 of them ought to be enough to keep us alive for 10 minutes anyways. Why am I carrying around all the plant fiber? Oh, we got that from harvesting the aloe, that's right. Getting a little low on plant fiber too, I'm going to have to go get some more of that. I'll right, throw this in here. No, we're not. We'll take this out. We'll throw this in. Then we can make some more star metal. Uh, no, we can't. We're out of black ice. Knew I should have grabbed some more while I was up there, and then I didn't. Let's go cook our roast haunch. Get that going in the meantime. Some of this other stuff away. We got plenty of tar, plenty of brimstone. Let's make a. Just make it all in the steel fire. We'll throw that in there. We'll throw our uh, little goofball turtle in. Nah, do we have any room? Sure, we. No, we don't. I guess we throw our goofy turtle over here. Uh, that's alright, we made uh, planted a couple of plants yesterday. We'll check on those, see if they're growing or not. Somebody mentioned that that's not working right now. A right, couple more things to put away. Need to go buy some uh, scorpion eggs, or not scorpion eggs, uh, rock nose eggs. Maybe we'll go buy an ugly chicken for some reason, I don't know. We'll go buy some pets though, just because, I don't know, because. <laughs> we have room in here for this? Sure we do. Take some more potions. You know, I think I'll throw the rest of the aloe in here and just make them all up, turn them all into potions right now. Twenty-three more. Satan's gamer, yeah, I like Brutus. There's uh, actually what? There's four or five of the named doggos that are greater doggos you can get. Brutus is the most common one. How you doing on your gruel? He's doing just fine. How's our water? We should probably refill our water. 
make a couple more foundations to take with us. We have our uh, little walkway with a map room going over to the well up in the volcano. I want to make that just a little bit bigger so that we can uh, have an easy walk around. Wild Mike, your Brutus died. Sorry to hear that. Yeah, once you get them fully leveled up, though, they're they're pretty tough. They're uh, they're probably comparable to uh, the white wolves you get here. Patty, your uh, your pet is bugged out as far as leveling goes. Uh, let's see, do we want to run up and get any more black ice right now? Yeah, let's do that because we need some ice to take with us too. Yeah, Satan, uh, he's Brutus is a pretty tough cookie. He's one of the better pets to have with you. I did a bunch of testing with uh, Brutus and the other named doggos against uh, the Sabertooths. The Sabertooths generally won more. Yeah, let's go see if we have a Delencia over here. Uh, just wouldn't attack or defend. Here, you carry that since you're no good at that and you need to practice. Let's go see who's over here. Ah, uh, just a fighter three and level one smelter. For her and us, we can we can grind that up. Yeah, looks good. That's all we want. We'll take that stuff. We'll get off these spikes because I think it was poking us in the head. It'd be a hell of a way to die. Seven to ten, and then thirteen upwards. They bugged out on you, huh? Mr. Ethos, good morning. How you doing? <laughs> Look on front porch for black ice. Did I have an ice delivery today, did I? <laughs> Thanks, Dogro. And here we go, not paying attention to our stamina again. Uh, let's jump down, thank you. Our buddy Rhino, we should take him around a little bit, get him leveled up sometime. No black ice on the front porch. <laughs> Marco, Bane of the Beasts. Nice. Thank you, Doggro. Thank you so much. Oh, that's plenty. But thank you, buddy. <laughs> Wild Mike never thought you'd be a be a stream watcher, huh? Oh, what am I doing in there? I don't need to go in there. Not enough room, fine. Alright, that'll get us that'll get us set up good for our uh we'll throw this in here for now along with the other stuff. Eric, kinda turn a blind eye to this, I'm just throwing stuff in benches right now. 
there's the doorbell. Hey, uh, Lester, let's get out of the way here. That, that scared the hell out of me the other day when uh, you or Rico did that. I thought I was getting the purge all of a sudden. <laughs> See, where is our purge meter anyways? Eh, we're a little better than halfway there. We got a little time. Thanks, Doggro. Appreciate it. We can throw that in there. Throw that in there. We'll throw the arrows in our somewhat arrow box. That can go there, and we'll just grind this up. Too bad you don't get the padding from the armor anymore. That was kind of a bummer when they took that out. <laughs> Brutal image. Yeah, this is uh, this is my server. I actually gave the password to a friend. He does all the admin stuff for me. Speaking of which, I don't think he changed the purge times back to what they originally were. Nah, he didn't. I have to get him to change these purge times back. I usually have them set the purge times for morning when my purge meters fall, just so we can get a purge on stream. But I forgot to tell him, and obviously he's forgotten about it because purge settings are still weekdays 10 to 12. Unless everybody else likes it like that, I'll leave it up to you guys. Uh, let's see, what were we doing here? I want that back, you can have that. Actually, I think I'm gonna see how he does with Telesoro. We've got 25% armor pen on it. A little better than the Star Metal Mace. He's looking a little a little slow and heavy with the uh, the mace. Kills on, you don't like the bone armor look? Brutal image, thanks so much for the sub. Uh, you know what? We could probably make it look a little better. Man, it, that guy looks like me in real life. Except I got a big pot belly and my pecs probably need a bra when I run down the stairs, you know, a little out of shape. <laughs> uh, let's see, we have one black die, midnight die, and the deep red kind of look black on them. There we go, a little black, and we just had the one green, got a couple cyans. Brutal image, you're running solo too. Yeah, the game is a lot more fun when you have friends. Uh, there, there's still a really good community in Conan Exiles. You can find a lot of people to play with. I would kind of maybe say though, uh, be careful who you let in your clan. There are people that like to uh, You know, do like inciting stuff. Where you let someone into your group, you're logged off, they'll go in and like despawn things. You gotta be a little careful about, you know, people that want to troll you and stuff. Yeah, dog road. I don't know, if everybody wants me to leave it in the morning, I'll have them leave it in the morning, or if you want to go back to the way it originally was, we can do that. I know this isn't true black. I don't think we have any white either. Now, when we're up at the volcano, I gotta try to remember to grab some more ash so we can make some more white dye. I swear some of the noises in this game sound like uh, sound like the birds and stuff off of uh, Scum. I wonder if that's where they got their uh, 
Or that's where they got all their noises from. Yeah, we'll leave that like that. I think we have to do the gloves yet. I know it's not real black, but those colors look dark enough to be black, so we're going to use them for now. There. That looks a little better. I usually like going with the black, white, and green on the bone armor. But, you know, it's all personal preferences. Great thing about the game, do it any way you want. Yeah, Minkin, uh, that's what I, I've been doing for the these two purges, uh, having my admin guy change purge time so I can get them during stream. Brutal image, yeah, you can do that. You playing on PC or console? All right, he's got his sword, he's got his shield. Oh, if I like the thralls running around with the shield, I'm gonna take it from him for now. We'll see how he works out. Maybe I'll give it back to him. And love tap, I do believe we left that on one of the other thralls. But which one? Was it you? Nope. How about you? I know it wasn't you. Uh, I don't believe it was either one of these guys. Guys, gals, whichever. He's still running around with a truncheon. If you're not, you can keep the truncheon. I tell you, when night falls in this game, it gets dark. But I'm not gonna, not gonna bitch about it. Aja's Bane, that's a pretty good uh, mace, actually. Who's got Love Tap? Which one of you creeps is holding on to it? There it is. What should we give Kiss this in the meantime? Demos is good with the uh, shield. I usually, uh, usually take the shields from them because, well, when you're out leveling them, they seem to spend more time shielding than actually attacking. There you go, kiss this. You can have that for now. We'll get you something different later, buddy. Don't worry. Don't, don't be looking so sad. Don't give me that look. I'll give you a better sword later on. I think, uh, I think Kiss This is a little sad I gave him that little sword. Doggo, you got over 100 potions, huh? <laughs> nice. Uh, yeah, I got a bunch of heals now. You're on PC, Brutal? The, uh... The direct connect to the server comes up in the chat every so often. Uh, it's, it's just exiled lands by Rotten John, you know, for lack of creativity in naming the server. Uh, feel free to join on here. There's, there's quite a few good people that play on here. And then I believe the... Uh, the direct connect for the servers in the the description of all the live streams too if you ever want to jump on all right what else was i going to get oh yeah some some foundations we'll take some of this here's the real question oh yeah i've got a little bit of hardened brick left and some of this want to make our little bridgeway just a, a little bit wider. 
I think we went with the hay covered foundations down there. Let's do 12 more. And I need to remember to take a little ice to put in our refrigeration box down there too. Ah, no problem, Brutal Image. There's, uh, like I said, there's a lot of good people that play on here. Alright, we got some foundations. Grab a little bit of ice. 38 there. 25 there. We'll take half of each one of these. I think we have some out here too. Ah oh, yeah, that's plenty of ice. Mink and milk, yeah. I'd love to have cross play on this game. I think it'd be great to be able to play with uh, console and PC players together. I think console getting in your radial wheel might be a little bit slower than PC. That might be a disadvantage there on PvP. I don't know. It's been so long since I've ever played on console. Uh, Satan's Gamer, no, the crossplay was actually crossplay on PC, and that was just between Steam, Microsoft, and they're launching the game on Epic Game Stores now. So the update was to get all three of those platforms all running the same version. Uh, that's where that crossplay comes in at. It, it wasn't, uh, wasn't for crossplay between PC and console unfortunately. But yeah, the crossplay they were talking about there was due to getting ready to launch on Epic Games Store. They have to have all the Microsoft, Steam, and Epic Games Store's launchers all on the same page. So that's what that crossplay was about. Unfortunately, it's not for PC and console. Alright, you got plenty of gruel. I don't remember if there was anything else we wanted to take with us. Go get rid of your mace, because I don't want to carry that around all day. Got our love tap. Got some healing potions. Oh, there's the front door bell. <laughs> Oh yeah, Night Eye Potion, thank you. Where, where'd he go? Oh, he's gone up there playing with the neighbors. Oh, there he is. <laughs> What's up, brothers? Um, yeah, this is the only one I can do that makes any noise. All my other, uh, all my other ones are kind of silent emotes. Ah, oh, nice little obsidian greatsword. Thank you, thank you. <laughs> Have fun. We'll see you around, buddy. <laughs> yeah, Satan's Gamer. I, uh, when I first read about the crossplay, and I got a little excited too, and then the more I dug into it, it was just crossplay between PC platforms. So it was kind of a little bit of a bummer. What we got here? 39 damage, or 75 damage, 39. Yeah, you're getting that there, buddy. Yeah, we'll go give, uh, we'll give poor Kiss this a little better sword here. He was looking a little sad that I give him that one. You know what else I thought about making and I keep forgetting about is, uh, The uh, Violet Curative. It's been a long time since I've 
use that. I want to see if it's still any good. The violet curative. What do we need? We just need serpent venom glands. All right, we got some of those. Make them. I think we have more. Oh no, we. Uh, I think we squished the life out of all of our venom glands. But we'll take it with us. And we'll put half of these over here. Alright, I think we're ready to go to the volcano and die. <laughs> Uber Eats, yeah. <laughs> Getting uh, ice delivered, getting potions delivered. <laughs> you know what? Here's here's what we're gonna do. This is gonna be the stream today. We're just gonna sit here. I'm gonna say, Dogro, Rico, you guys want to go to the heart of the volcano and defeat the boss for me? <laughs> and we'll just sit here and wait to hear back from him. <laughs> All right. I, I guess we should actually do play some of the game. <laughs> and we'll try to remember to go to the right portal here. scary volcano still have yet to go exploring all that other side and the other area behind here yet too now there's a boss spider over there uh, a couple other things that we can you know find that'll gladly kill us over that way good thralls here and there to find Yeah, Eric, we all could go as a team. Who's this? DMA, right off the bat. Uh, yeah, Lestred, I was gonna, like, hang on here, buddy. Hang on here, buddy. Give me that sword before you kill him. No, give me your sword. Too late. He's probably already out dead. I don't want your inventory. Come on, get out of here. Go away. We're a little too slow on that one. Life story. <laughs> Mystery Thos, the dancer got you killed, huh? Yeah, they, they generally don't make very good uh, fighters. They're, they're good for, like, uh, inside your base defense, things like that, maybe. You know what? I see something dumb here that I, I have to try. It's probably going to be a really bad idea. know if I could make that jump or not. It's probably a, just a bad idea. Probably shouldn't do it. <gasps> Should probably ignore my bad ideas. We're not here to play around with bad ideas today, I guess. <laughs> All right, just in case there's anybody decent over there, I'll give you that right now. Looks like just regular fighters and archers here. Yep, nobody specials. There 
you can have your uh, you can have your little toy sword back, buddy. All right, betting windows are open. How many times will I die on the way to the center of the volcano today, or the heart of the volcano? <laughs> Maybe if I can not try to ride the uh, rock nose, we'll do better too. Ah. Kind of noisy in this area. Oh, I know what else I want to do. I wanted to bring a, another, uh, or bring a fountain down here with us. So we could grab a drink of water every once in a while or refill our uh, water skins. Alright, do we want to extend it that way or bring it out over this way a little? Should probably bring a few more ramps down here too, just to. It's not even going to let us place anything over there. Fine. Whatever. We'll just settle with that. Oh, we already had a hood. Uh, let's see, we need to get some ice in here. Didn't bring any extra gruel with us, but that's alright. I don't know why we're still carrying that around, but we got it. You bring a bedroll? I got one right here. Got one here, so that if I do die, We've got some armor, a little weapon, got some heals here, got some ice that we can grab. I think, think I got it covered. Still a long run back to where we're heading though from here, but I think we'll be alright. Yep, 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 excuse me, excuse me, coming through. at what we have you set at. Just guard me. That'll be fine. A whole bunch of friendly uh, fighter threes in this area. We don't have, we haven't collected any obsidian or anything yet, so I don't think we'll bother with going down to the well right now. No reason to get into the well right, right now at this point. When we do start collecting obsidian, I'll probably bring a few uh, poison orbs with us and we've got our poison arrows because then we can always climb up on the uh, little stand that's down in that area. Just kind of cheese our way through all the NPCs there. Alright, one of these, there's a little pathway down. Obsidian, you bring obsidian down here, and the well, right right in the center of the screen there. You fight your way down there, and you use the obsidian, and I believe it's steel bars, to make your obsidian, uh, your actual obsidian bars. Yeah, we'll try that, Mr. Ethos. Well, probably shouldn't have tried it right at this moment, but we'll get them set here in a minute. Come 
Bones, you just started and you're getting hit with a sandstorm already. <laughs> Goodbye, boys. <laughs> Yeah, it'd be nice if they had a, uh, had like a sandstorm exclusion for when you just spawn in. And it, it's it's pretty dangerous in this area. You end up getting getting dead pretty quick through here. Uh, no, that's not what I wanted. Follow distance. Rid of some of these PIAs through here. Hey, uh, Lester, what you doing? You gonna help out any? Nah. You don't like the settings I have you on? Nothing I want from you. Ah, we'll take your steel, I guess. I don't think we need uh, any more glowing essence. Black dye, we'll take that. Compost, we're good on there. Yeah, Rico, uh, when you first spawn it, it'd be nice to have a safe area from the sandstorm. Get him, Lester. At. I'll send him over there to play with those guys too. Anything good? Nah. Man, this area is loud with the headphones on. Strip. Chop them down. Cut them all down. Yeah, a little late now, but we can put a little poison on our weapon. Now, well, let us put it on there now. What we get from this guy? Nothing. Nothing much. Probably shouldn't worry about too much of the steel really down here. Take some rhino head soup, sure. Come on, Lester. We got places to go. Good, buddy. We'll take some fish. I'll well take the steel just because. Should probably uh, work on getting our health back up. We get to the third perk in our attributes on vitality. No, we didn't. That's kind of a dumb mix there. I need that. Need that third perk. Gonna have to redo our uh, redo our attributes. 
Wish I would have checked that before I came in here. Now we got a snake doing some kind of dance over here. Go get that guy. I'll get the snakes. Okay, now we got everybody over here. Snake is still on Lester at. I hear another snake somewhere. There it is. How you doing there, Lester at? You're doing just fine. I think it's us we got to worry about. <laughs> oh, three of these guys now? Why three of you? You used to only be one of you. kind of disappeared on us. And here's the old leap of faith that I hate doing because half the time I end up down there. Lester, he'd be rocking now, that's right. Well, here we go. We only live once. Oh, we just made it. Ooh wee. My well, Lester, you can do it. Where'd you go, buddy? Eh, a little more steel. There you are. You made the jump too. Good to see. Let's go get rid of some more of these uh, creepy snake-looking people. Yeah, these guys could like maybe chill out on some of the talking. It's pretty loud in these headphones. <laughs> Where's our boss guy to open the door? Should be over here. Or is he standing up here with these guys now? Go get him, Lester. Yeah. <laughs> 
Okay, just like fall over dead there so we can get in. Oh, here's the boss guy over here. He wasn't spawned in yet. Or not the boss guy, but the door guy. Keeper of the larder. Whatever a larder is. Get all kinds of rhino head soup down here. Yeah, Eric, that, that jump doesn't always go well for everybody. And I think we need to fight all these guys. We're going to try to skirt around the back way here. Hello, hello, hello. Just, ouch. Don't shoot me with your arrows, please. Can you, like, please stop? Snakes are biting us. And we're about out of stamina. Too far to die now. Water orb. Yeah, we'll take it just because we can use it. Need some highland berries? Why not? I don't know why these guys have highland berries down here. How you doing there, Lesterette? You doing fine. Where is he at? 25 in strength, 37 in vitality, not counting the bonuses. Good thing we brought an extra stack of heals. And let's see, somewhere around here is a little easier way to get over there. Scared the hell out of me there. Thought somebody was coming to rip my face off again. Thought there was a little ledge we could jump across here. I could feed them better. Yeah, I could, but you know, gruel's so easy. It's only two points less for uh, the growth percent chance on them. I'm all about the easy stuff. Eric, the whirlwind blades aren't causing bleed anymore. I was fighting a couple of the lizard guys there. I noticed uh, I wasn't stacking any bleed on them with the uh, uh, knives either. This guy's just going to like camp this area and Biff me right in the face as soon as I climb up there. back here peppering me with arrows trying to make me look like his personal pin cushion good 
could use uh, the shield we took. That'd be like work. And nothing I really want to lug out of here on you. What about you? What do you have? This will take a whole... Make a set of uh, Skelos armor. Yeah, you know what? We'll use your healing wrap. How about that? Yeah, Doggerl, if that's the case. Hopefully it's just uh, something temporarily bugged out with the bleed. Go away, stupid little snake. Go get him. Go get him. Go get him. No, go get him. There you go. Get him, get him, get him. You can do it. The Serpent Man Brute, huh? Let's not stand in front of him. Yeah, right now all we're doing is just crippling this guy and getting stuck in the rocks. And not able to hit him. Got anything good on you? Oh yeah, there's a set of shoes. Take some daggers, sure, some throwing axes. Never used them before. I think the only time I ever used any throwing axes is back when there was the old exploit where you could throw the axe on the ground and stand on top of it and you were pretty much invincible. Yeah, let's see if this guy's still broken here. And uh, Lesterette here. They don't even care about me. Well, that guy was kind enough to hit us once, anyways. Triples now he is. some more. Hey, look at that. We got our shiny trapezohedron thingy. It's no longer broken. Nice. Let's go raid some chests. Learn some recipes. And take it all. Alright, learned all of our obsidian tools. Sweet. Take it all. We'll take everything. Until I can't carry anymore. Well, maybe not everything. 
Yeah, not everything. Take a little socket set, because why not? A little bit of oil, a little bit of steel, a little bit of thick leather, sure. So yeah, for those of you that are still new to the game, come back in here and defeat this guy. And then back on this wall is your recipe stone for all of your obsidian items. Now we can actually use the obsidian well. Ghost voice sounds like the black speech from The Hobbit. <laughs> I forgot all about that movie. I haven't seen that in a long time. Maybe that's why I'm not seeing the uh, the bleed effect. Then the uh, Serpent Man brutes don't aren't affected by it, Rico. I'll try it on something else just to make sure it's still working. I know it was working yesterday when uh, we we're using the daggers. And here comes another one of these jumps. This one isn't as bad, though. You could almost fall off of this one and make it. Let's get healed up and get a little running start. Well, kind of sorry to disappoint everybody, but we didn't die on our way there. I figured a couple of deaths anyways. Now we're going to get the aggro of these boneheads. Yeah, we're not here to monkey with you guys. I don't have any obsidian yet. Garp, uh, wearing the royal armor, I believe it was Doggerkett gave it to us. It's uh, it's an armor you got with the uh, pre-ordering the game way back years ago when the game was first new. Yep, angry people here. Was that? Oh, that was just a regular old fighter. See if there's anybody interesting around the corner here. Up behind me, are you? Ah, Jazz, Jazz Pills, whatever her name is there. See if we can hit this guy once more. Uh, Lesterette stays occupied over there. Nope, she's going over to fight with Lesterette now. Don't fight with Lesterette, he'll just kill you, lady. Lesterette, give me that sword. Ah, oh, you killed her. You killed her. I'll take her sword, anyways. 
Ow. Why you gotta ruin my heal? Would you knock out here? Just another nobody. I changed his name to Dingus. He killed a good uh, bow maker. Anybody else around? Huh, angry person up there. Women throwing fireballs at us. Well, you guys went into the void. See you in a minute. got over here. Yeah, go down there and get him. More coffee? Yes, Eric. I am I am feeling the desire for coffee now. Can you hold still so I can at least hit you once? Thank you. Instead of killing her, but we don't want an archer three right now. Yeah, I'm gonna leave the love tap on him. Never know who you're gonna run into up around here. Couple of coinage. Satan's gamer, I'm with you on that. Have separate uh Truncheon and uh, weapon commands, yeah, that'd be great. That would come in real handy. level. Hello? Anybody here? There we go. Who are you? Just an archer three? I'll try to hit you. Bouncing on top of these guys, I could actually fight them. Yeah, that, that guy's gone, Lester. Where are you at now? You're level 9? Nice, it'll be uh, 10 pretty soon. Alright, what do we have left for heals? Two heals. 
See if we find anybody on this level. We'll work our way back up towards the obelisk area. Want to grab some uh, uh, raw ash before we leave here so I can make some more white dye. Find somewhere safe to hang out so yours truly can go get his coffee. that big guy. You distract him, I'll watch your back. Sound like a plan? Sound like a plan to me. You're not distracting him very good, Lester. got for us there, buddy. Man, I would take that. That's about all we want, though. And no. Oh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're getting pretty thirsty. Tell you happy Thanksgiving, but uh, go away. Ah, uh, ruined my heel. Why would you do that? It's you over there, huh? Knock out over here, Lester. And Archer 3. We already got our Serpent Man stuff. We keep him busy and I'll take the I'll take the hard guy here. Maybe. He's pretty dodgy. It'd be a lot easier if I gave Lester at his weapon back, but as soon as I give him his weapon back, we'll find somebody good, and Lester will just kind of like kill him. So no weapon for you, Lester. Any good on you? Couple of coins. Last heal. We're going to have to start working our way out of here.
somebody good laying around here, huh? You're dead. But you know what? We're gonna take your sword, because you don't need it anymore. That's the Archer 3. That's just one of those guys. Yep, I'm gonna say this was a trip that uh, didn't pan out so good. Let's go try to get some uh, We'll get a little bit of raw ash and then we'll get out of here for the, for now. Always nice running into other people. Is there anything we want to leave here? We'll leave some fish here. We'll leave our rhino head soup here just for one of those days we get in trouble in here. Leave one of these swords in here. Sure, looks good to me. That's right, we have a thrall up here on the wheel. We go back up this way. Well, so far, no death and mayhem. This is the one we want. See if there's anybody up here at the top of the stairs or over by the wheel. We'll grab our uh, grab our thrall off of there and head back home. Anything in here? Eh, yeah, we'll take a shelf. A little more steel, why not? I always use steel. Dark Angel, how you doing? Thank you so much. Fighter 3. Not anymore. And who are you? Archer 2. Yeah, a little more steel. Sure, why not? shoot me with an arrow to begin with, you'd still be alive. Oh, that's right, we didn't get to put a thrall on here because Lester Eck killed him. That damn Lester Eck getting all crazy and wild in here every now and then. These are just usually Archer and Fighter 3's on this bridge. Uh, two this time. Thank you for the sub. What's this guy got on him? 
Yeah, a little more steel. We got room for steel. We're out of heels, though. I think the best bet is going to be head back home for now. Otherwise, I'm going to end up dead over there somewhere. Won't be able to make it down to... Well, I could just spawn at our box there. Yeah, let's get out of here for now. Why push the rotten luck when the luck is rotten, right? Come on, Lestret, let's go home for a minute. I think we get back to our base here, do the belly dance for uh, Patty, and I'm gonna go fill my coffee cup again. So I think this way should be Dog Rose base. Stop by, take a quick look at his base. Oh, ah, yeah, all nice and lit up here. Got himself a nice little wheel room there, a wheel gondola. Sweet. Got himself a few dragon heads. Nice, nice. Yeah, Fluffy. Fluffy the nice cat. I'm kind of afraid to pet it, though. It looks like it'll probably eat my fingers right away. Doggo, place is coming along nice here. Wipe our feet off and go take a look inside. Nice little welcoming area, a little pub going here. Hells yeah. Come up here and, uh, like, yeah, uh, give me a beer. Maybe two beers. Maybe another beer for my buddy over there. Pretty nice. Yeah. Thing's got a big butt. Look at that, a little bit of black, white, red. That looks good. Got Nipper, huh? Yeah, we're not gonna pet him either. I think we already got the warning. He's a he's a biter. Got us a Delencia going. Nice. I hear. Uh, I hear scorpion pets around here somewhere. That door must have been the dog rose personal chambers. Where do I hear the scorpions at? I know I hear them. Oh, there they are. Queen scorpion, king scorpion, nice. Got a little lucky with your uh, scorpion pets. Nice. The animal pen, all kinds of animals around here. Doggo, you got you got a zoo going. All right, let's get out of here before our thrall pisses his uh, pets off and we end up getting dead. That looks nice with the uh, the, the, the Ymir religion altar up there. Oh, Jabal Sag. Yeah, should have known. When you farm materials, they disappear. You mean disappear out of your inventory? That's a bug I've been noticing with the tables too lately. Like if your uh, if your inventory for your tables is pretty full, they won't show up in your inventory until you get out of your inventory, then go back into it.
Doggo, man, you are, uh, you're like rocking on everything here. So we. Oh, in front of you they disappear? I don't know. That's got to be some kind of animation glitch then. I haven't seen that happening yet while I've been out farming. Yeah, Eric, that's true because it's Conan. Can't say I could ever do any better with the game, though. I mean, it's it's a massive game. You make one change somewhere, and it's... The devs probably know every time they make a change, it's going to bug something else out somewhere else. That's got to be like a an ongoing, never-ending fight with that. There are a few things they could uh, actually get fixed, though, that have been in game forever. It would be nice. But what do I know? I'm not a developer. Yeah, you still have love tap. Yeah, you know what? We'll take another another berserker goofball here. And we'll step right in front of his attacks. Why not? We're almost home. You gotta die at least once. I mean, what, what kind of stream is this going to be if I don't at least die once? This could be a new record for the Rotten John streams. <laughs> See, Lester, good thing I was here because I got him for you. Oh, uh, you know what? I think I put the wrong sword in the box in the volcano. We'll have to dress this sword up a little bit. Should have paid attention to which one I was throwing in the chest down there. That's alright, we'll go back and get it. Not a problem. Yeah, it could be a it could be an animation glitch on console. Think of the bugs if they add magic. Oh yeah, I'm sure. I wonder uh, if they do add magic to the game. I wonder what size game we're going to be looking at. I mean, we're at what, like... We're at a, a final install of 70 gigabytes. Uh, maybe a, an initial install of... Is it 90 gigabytes right now? And then after it's installed, it uh, tames back down a bit. Let's see, what do we need in here? Take a whole bunch of food. Got no more leaves, of course. Lester, how about uh, how about sharing some of some of your gruel? Excuse me. Building glitches? Yeah, I would have to say uh, those are probably the worst because the building's probably probably one of the better building systems out there. And then when it does glitch, it does get pretty, uh, pretty annoying. I really can't hate on the game. I mean, no, we don't want that one. We got Eerie, yeah, we got Eerie done. Eerie gave us some trouble up at the volcano yesterday. We're going to throw him over here in our thrall box for now. Invisible NPCs attacking, yeah, Satan's Gamer. That that used to happen a lot in Sepa Maru. The uh, thralls would go invisible on you. I haven't seen that happen in a while, though, but it used to be a common thing. I gotta go get some more uh, aloe already, don't I? Good lord. I'll go through plant fiber and aloe like it's going out of style in this area. Alright, let's see. We'll put all you guys away in here. Hardened steel hammer. I think we, yeah, we've got one. Probably won't ever use it up at the uh, Frost Giant Temple. Yeah, Eric, sometimes that's uh, caused by stability on your build. 
and other times it's caused by well you know just the game not wanting to work right uh, let's see we could throw that in there Ooh, we got another candle love me some candles I think we'll put it by this door and light up the door a little bit there perfect we now have candlelight how romantic or something I don't know Throw, yeah, we'll throw you in there. Oh, there's the front doorbell again. Got away, Lester. At. <laughs> What's up? <laughs> oh, tons of goodies. Oh, thank you. Oh, yeah, I forgot all about the raw ash farming it up there. Thank you so much. <laughs> I totally forgot about the raw ash. I am king of CRS though, ain't I? Aren't I? What hour you say it? Yeah, now we can make some more white dye. Where's our white dye? That's the colorant. There's our white dye. Make 11. I think we have a bunch of glass flasks laying around over here. Have to go fill them with water, make some more white and black dye got 27 of them should probably or no we have 47 yeah we're good for a while there an invisible sandstorm yeah those those happen every off every so often too yeah mink and milk doorbells work good uh, let's see go to one of your uh, artisan benches and there's two versions of the horn. The ivory war horn, I don't believe makes any noise. It never used to. It may now, but I know for sure that the, the regular horn is the one that you can interact with and makes all the noise. And it just takes some uh, branches and some bones to make. Raw crash. Yes, Rico. <laughs> Raw ash, raw crash. Gotta be careful I don't say raw ass. I don't know. That that might slip out sometime. <laughs> oh, we didn't even use our uh, eye potion and our violet curative. I forgot we had that on us, too. So yeah, I'm gonna get a few things put away here, and then I'm gonna... Go into the belly dance and uh, go get a coffee. I am, uh, I think I'm going to start collecting donations though. Maybe I can buy a new wife because she's not getting me coffee very good, you know. Where's our shiny trahipa? <sighs> Trap is the whole heat. Uh, yeah, the shiny thing, that thing. That, 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 yeah, that thing. I'm going to put it in the box over there. Eventually, no, not you. Eventually, before I go to SIPTA, I'm going to make up the uh, key. Join, uh, join a clan with somebody, and then I'm going to go use the key, and someone can have all of this stuff on the server. Because then I'll, I'll eventually move over to SIPTA. And then if I do come back to play on this server, I'll, uh, you know, I'll start all over fresh because that's how we roll here. <laughs> Something like that. I'm trying to sound like a cool teenager. <laughs> there you go, buddy. You can have your, you can have your shield back. Kind of done with you for right now. We gotta find. Lieutenant Dingus and uh, finish getting him leveled up too. Alright, what else did we have to put away here? A few more little things to put away. Then it's belly dance time and coffee time. Oh yeah, I gotta get some coffee. Let's see a shelf. Where can we put the shelf? I don't have any.
have any room. You know, we can put the shelf out here. I know where to put it. There, we stack a couple more chests on there eventually. I think later tonight I'm going to do a bunch of farming and start doing some organizing here. I want to tear all these shelves and uh, chests down, respace them out, so I can put the small little signs above them and then know what's in each one. Starting to hoard enough stuff here that, like Eric's brain, my brain is starting to itch when I look at the storage. <laughs> Yeah, I'm making a, I don't, I don't mind starting over. This has been a really, uh, real fun kind of learning experience for me again. After you've been level 60 and done everything in the game so long that you really forget about the struggles in, in the beginnings of the game. It's a good, uh, good reset. Let's see, we'll carry these with us. They're not, they don't weigh too much. Where'd I put the other things? There we go. We have to make separate storage boxes for all these things. It's starting to look pretty cluttered. All right, Patty, this is for you. I'm gonna go grab a cup of coffee. I will be right back with you guys. There's the dance. <laughs> I'll be right back with you guys. All right, we're back. Gotta love the uh, bun coffee maker. Dump the water in, bam, you got a cup of coffee. Making milk. 
your character is uh, short and bald, huh? <laughs> All right. <laughs> Anybody know if the uh, the orb of Nagral is working right yet? We still haven't made that. I might make that up here soon and probably just toss it out here somewhere. See, our other thralls should be done cooking in the Wheel of Friendship now. We'll throw him in a box. We'll have plenty of backup in boxes here when we need them. Wrong box. Sesame, you five foot eight, long hair and a beard, real life or character wise? Alright, do we have our love tap back? Yeah. Let's go see if we can find uh, Captain Dingus. I have no idea where he is. These thralls are all in different spots every day. Yesterday he was over here by the Wheel of Friendship. We'll go take a look there, see if he's over there still. Could run around with him for a little bit, get a couple more levels on him. There he is. He's at 15, he's got five more to go, and then we give him a new permanent name. And like it was pointed out, yes, I actually gave him a demotion from captain to lieutenant. Didn't think about that until after stream, but yeah, this is the rotten lands. Things kind of go wonky here anyways, so yeah, we'll leave it for now. <laughs> <laughs> Patty. <laughs> That's something you give your wife, huh? Well, let's see where we want to go with Dingus. Could run over the Black Keep again and do that. So we can make another Telesoro. Or you know what? I think. We're going to go get some, a couple more Nordheimer hearts. I think we have a few of those up here somewhere. Yeah, we got three hearts of a hero, and I think we have some Nordheimer hearts. Yeah. How long before these guys expire? Ten minutes? E. That one's going to expire any time. Uh, yeah, I don't think we're going to be able to run with those. Let's go down to Hannah Man's Grotto. Major Dingus. Yeah, that's probably going to end up being his final name. We haven't been to Hannah Man's Grotto yet. Let's go down there. See, that's in H3, I believe. Yeah, like right around middle-ish of H3. Oh, and who was it? Was it, uh, who was asking about where to get the, uh, fragments of power? We'll run through the city real quick, see if any of them are laying on the ground. Point out those locations for you real quick here. <coughs> nope, wrong way. If you come into the obelisk, one of the first easy ones to find is right here at the bottom of this tower we're looking at. Minkin, that's right. So right down there, you see there's the box right there. Haha, missed me. Come down here and right on this pad you'll find a box sitting here and that'll have a fragment of power in it. Fragment of powers have real goof, goofy uh, respawn timers on them. Depending on who you ask, they'll tell you a different amount of time. Now we took a little damage on that. <laughs> 
I don't want to go with my inventory. Ah, uh, don't. You rotten little bastard, you ruined my heel. Oh, I gotta fix this uh, axe up too before we lose it. As I proceed to pound on skeletons with it. I think we brought another weapon with us we can swap out for either. I will just try to do a quick run through, show you where three of the real easy to get to uh, fragments of power are usually laying. Another one is just up above the obelisk. Gonna run off to the left of the obelisk. Mark, thank you so much for the subscription. Yeah, I think we're going to have to go back and get a different weapon. I don't want to lose this uh, Yogg's Touch Axe yet. Although, we could get rid of those guys and pick up a heart of a hero, too. Hey, I see you. Oh, you brought your buddies with you, too, didn't you? Guess what? We're not interested in you. Nah, I haven't. I didn't do uh, any attribute respecting yet. Uh, Minkin, here's another spot where you'll find a chest. You'll see a little box here. You'll find a fragment of power in there. And there's the obelisk where you spawn in. And that's just running to the left of the ob or the right of the obelisk. Swing around here and then run up the hill, and you'll find it up top there. <gasps> now where's Dingus at? He got himself lost in you. There he is, Dingus. This way. You're going the wrong way, buddy. This way. Yeah, it's me. See me. Your buddy coming? I don't know. That's why he got the name Dingus. A little dingy sometimes. See, we're going the right direction. No. Need to go past the uh, the back guy and then over. Yeah, well, we'll try to remember to respec. I don't know. See how that works out. <laughs> Seems to be a good day for CRS. Although, somehow we've stayed alive all day. Alright, we need to head over this way a bit. I have to have Dingus do all our fighting for us and hand amends. Yogg's touch is getting pretty low on health. In the name of Set, identify yourself. Hey, here's these guys that are always angry and want to tear your face off. And on one of these dunes here, you should see the corner of a uh, fragment box sticking out. Oh, don't hit me. I'm just looking for your fragment of power box. I thought it was on this dune right here. Get up here where they can't pepper us with arrows. Or right here on the map, right inside the city, just off of the southeast tip there. Dingus, you got them guys? Oh, you just got shot in the face with an arrow, didn't you? Guess we could help him out with our daggers a little bit. Uh, 
lady. You get a little carried away with your knife there. It's like not nice. Yeah, making right around here. I thought it was this dune here. Right next to him. It might be one of these other dunes. It's just like the corner tip of a uh, fragment of power box that you'll see sticking up out of the ground. Or out of the sand here. And it's easy to run past. Dingus, you get rid of those guys? See what they have in their chest. A little bit of gold. Nice. We'll take it. Take some gold dust, too. Or is everybody else you got rid of? Take some more gold coins. We like gold. Makes us feel rich. Oh, look at that. The wife brought me another fresh cup of coffee. She's the best. Shaking her fist at me, too. I don't know. Get a little scary sometimes. <laughs> Thanks, honey. Where's uh, where's the captain at over here? What did you do with him, Dingus? Dingus pounded him into the ground. Was fighting them right here in this area. I have to leave the area and come back to it. Let's eat a little bit here before we starve to death. Drink a little water. Ah, uh, yeah, it feels good, doesn't it? <laughs> Mr. Ethos, have a good day. Kills on the throne of uh, Skelos, yeah. Although I don't remember if we learned that one yet or not. I can't even tell what sand dune we're looking at in the dark here. But yeah, Minkin, there's a uh, somewhere on one of these dunes right by where these uh, relic hunters are. You'll see just the tip of a box sticking up. It almost looks like a rock like that. You'll see it on the side of one of these dunes. That'll have another fragment of power in it. And it's far enough away from these uh, relic hunters that you can run by and grab it and then get out of there before you get their aggro and they catch up to you. Happy wife, happy life. Yeah, I might have to work on, work a little more on keeping her happy. Kukapet, hope I'm not murdering your name. Thank you so much for the sub. Well, if it ever gets daylight around here, we might be able to find the captain, what's his name, that Dingus kind of got rid of for us. Thought I'd take the uh, heart of a hero along with us too, but we can't find the guy's body. Gotta be right around here somewhere. There's the other two, and I think the, the captain should have been right through here. If daylight ever, you know, decides to come around, might be able to find him a little easier. Might even have a better chance of finding our other fragment of power box. Uh, in game time is almost three in the morning. Yeah, we don't have too much longer before it gets daylight. See how that rock looks there, Minkin? That's what you'll see on the side of one of these dunes here. 
I swear it was on this dune right here. It may not even be spawned in right now. But I swear it was on the, the side of this dune where you'll, you'll see a little, looks like a corner of a rock sticking up out of the dune. You grab that and it's another uh, fragment of power box. Satan's Gamer, good to always see you. Your work day's almost done, that's great. It's best time of day, break time and end of the work shift time. <laughs> Watch out there, dingus. Those things like to pop up underneath you there. Yeah, it's finally starting to get daylight out. Maybe we can find this uh, captain over here, get his heart, take that to Hanneman's Grotto with us. But I'm still not seeing the guy. Thinking he must have fell through the mesh. And I really don't want to run far away and then come back just for the heart of a hero. <laughs> Minkin, you're trying to see too, yeah. Yeah, it could just be that it's not spawned in. Somebody might have gotten it earlier and it's not spawned back in yet. And that's just a rock. But yeah, right in this area here is where you're going to find it. Right about uh, close to the D and E 5 line. Right around this area. That's where the relic hunters spawn in right here. And it should be up along this uh, sand dune here. Where you'll find the uh, just just the tip of the box that sticks out. Don't believe it's any farther up here. Take a little jaunt away, see if the uh, captain reappears. If not, we're heading down to Hanneman's Grotto. <laughs> Minkin, it's almost like. Uh, Finding sand in the desert, huh? That oddly sounds like it could be hard. <laughs> hey, let's make our way back over to where they spawn in. See if the uh, see if the guy's body's laying there. Yeah, I think Dingus has got social distress order or something like that. He, he seems to eat a lot of the thralls. Yep, yep, yep. Scorpions. Who cares? Ah, scorpions on us. Now we care. job, Dingus. Alright, where we need to go here? Up over this way a little bit. We'll see if these uh, this guy's spawned in, and if not, we're out of here. Now I'm kind of all turned around backwards in here. probably really should be running through this area a lot more often just to get more of the uh, fragments of power bunch more feet points I want to learn and I want to start getting into the there he is he's back I want to start getting into the archivist chamber ah he just decayed while we were running up to him still got his heart though 
We're all right. All right, let's go down to Hanneman's Grotto. Ah, yeah, that's good coffee. Why is coffee? Ah, here it is, right here. Here's our fragment of power. Right here, and five E. E5, right along the wall. That's where you're going to find the fragment of power hanging out in the sand here, which is just a little southeast of where the relic hunters spawn in. So, bam! Another fragment of power. I think we have three of them now. Yeah, we picked up three of them. If we're not too overly encumbered when we leave Hanamans, we'll come back in here. Maybe we'll learn a few more. Uh, I'd like to fight that guy too, but our axe is almost dead. Yeah, you got that thing, Dingus. You gotta do a little more and kick him. Die outside him! There you go, buddy. Alright, we need to head over to H3 area. Come on, Dingus. We're on another adventure. Was not a good grab. Yeah, I could have sworn it was closer to where the uh, relic hunters spawn, but yeah, it's it's a little bit away from a little bit to the southeast of them there. And as of right now, the uh, Zath Religion Trainer is still bugged out. Update 2.7, though, does fix them. So we'll be able to go in and learn our Zath Religion as soon as Update 2.7 comes out uh, on the live branch. I really need to respec. This uh, not having the passive regeneration kind of a bummer. Going through a lot of heels. Woohoo! We're running. Not that I can't take you, but I don't want to kill my sword or my axe yet. Making you have your killing tomorrow? Nice. The uh, the heat saving kiln that's that's not too overly big, but my base is still a little cramped. I may have to move things around in there. Oh, there's a uh, corrupted one of the green-eyed uh, shale backs over there too. place for a whole lot of reptile hide. But that's not what we're here for. News of when the update's coming? No, it's it's probably anybody's guess. Typically it goes to uh, Tesla branch for at least two weeks. Yeah, Minkin, there's, there's the kiln you can learn at, at the archivist chamber. Which uh, I believe it was Dogracat did give us one of those. I don't think we we learned it yet either. Let's see, it's under survival all the way down at the bottom. Now we haven't we didn't learn the uh, kiln out of there yet.
But there, there's the kiln you learn from a scroll from the archivist chamber, which is one I usually like to build. It takes up so much less space inside your base, and it has the storage capacity of close to the heat, uh, the heat furnace that you can make. Bones, he's laying unconscious there. Uh, dingus, want to give him mouth to mouth, wake him up? Nah. All right, we'll leave him sleeping. Yeah, we got a little ways to go yet here. Getting close. We're getting close. I think we'll go into Hannah Men's Grotto. Call the day for today. Pick it back up again tomorrow. I think that base over there is an abandoned base. I don't think that player's been on the server in a while. I'll have to see, I have my admin guy see if this person's maybe ever coming back or not, and if not, just delete his base. Dingus, you got my back, all right. You the man. I'm sure would take a little bit of that. Yeah, Eric, that's, that's probably the better way to uh, explain it. There's one kiln you learn from the scroll, and then four different types of furnaces. I think we're back this way. Been a while since I've been here. Kill sound. Your your wolf is partially in and out of the wall. <laughs> all right, here's all the little imps running around. We're getting close now. Gotta be around here somewhere. I know it's around here somewhere. We're in the right area. This, where the hell's the opening at? Must be around the other side here. There we go. There's our opening. Going in with daggers blazing. Yep. Uh, spot outside of centers. I'll have all of my guy look into that too. Yeah, if you guys see any bases that look abandoned, especially ones that say no owner, those are probably been people that haven't been back here in a long time. Uh, let me know in the or in Discord. Oh, someone else might have already been through here. Let me know on the Discord, though, and uh, we'll get some of the old stuff cleaned up. We got hanging out over here. Raz, how you doing? Can't, can't get up on the rock. I'm a little stuck there. How's it going, buddy? Let's go, uh, let's go get rid of this guy here and... Uh, well, now that that doesn't look good. <laughs> Let's go get rid of this guy over here and see if we can get some. Uh, see if we can get a, uh, you know, one of those furry yeti-looking things. done. I think we got to get a little heart from him so we can open up the box. 
Deep drink water skin. Yeah, why not? Alright. Well, we got Hannah Men's gifts out of it. Uh, sorry, horse, you're in the way there. We got another Hannah Men's gift. I think we're going to strike out here. Yep. Nothing good out of it. Raz, you have uh, hearts you need to turn in? Drop them on the floor, I'll turn them in for you if you want. Uh, I just got a bunch of the... Where'd they go? The Hanneman's Gift Potions here. I don't know if you can access it or not. As I'll read our little... Oh, Lord of the Darkness. Little of notes men here. Are not men. Give us yep, read the notes. Suffering in equal measure. Let our bodies be pleasing to you. Cheryl, your internet just got fixed. Nice. Yeah, we had trouble with ours for the longest time. It's still not Let us find still not all the way right yet. And loose them upon the earth. We give our Well, we gave up our hearts and only got Hanneman's gifts. I mean they're okay. You use it and the power of your mind. Oh, you got the same Raz. But you use your Hanneman's gift and up in the upper left corner there you see that we have increased accuracy bonus from Hannah Man's gift and we go into our stats let's see where does it show on there it does not show why does it not show well, anyways you, you use Hannah Man's gift and you get random bonus attributes Raz good seeing you again you got the same thing huh well, I guess we can't be winners all the time all right we're gonna head back to base I think this is probably where uh, we get ready to wrap up the stream let's go the underwater route here Raz, that means you uh, you fought the king imp that's in here and got a uh, got an iron pot from him. What an odd thing to give out as a uh, boss drop. <laughs> an iron pot. I think uh, there's a base just up the river here that has a map room on it. Wow, I made it through a whole stream without dying. I don't know what's up with that, but... Vinny boy, you got a, uh, you got one of the gray apes out of it? Was it, is it the gray ape that's the, I think it's the, the gray apes that are the better ones, aren't they? Didn't turn out as good as you thought? Yeah. Yeah, they're pets. The, they don't make for the best fighters. Let's see, I think we're heading in the right direction here. I could be wrong. It's not like I haven't been wrong before, right? <laughs> Eric, thank you. Always glad to see you guys here. Enjoy hanging out with you guys a lot. But yeah, you know, we didn't die 50 times, so yeah. Wasn't that exciting today. Huh? Yeah, I think we'll head back to the base though. Call the day there and uh, see if I can get the wife to bake some cookies or something. <laughs> Don't tell her though. Hope she ain't watching the stream. I gotta, gotta come up with a tactic on how to talk her into it. <laughs> 
Uh, I think I went too far, actually. See, there it is. There's the base. Somewhere over here is a another guaranteed uh, wandering fighter. I think they spawn right in this area, just like on the other side of uh, the Shattered Bridge. Yeah, there he is. There's another guaranteed uh, wandering fighter there. Arnos, I think you're in trouble now, buddy. Yep, you're in trouble. What'll Arnos have on him? Some more... Oh, he's got the medium gauntlets. Yeah, we don't want him. See, while we're in the water, might as well fill up our water skins. I don't think I need four water skins. Should have gave the other one the Raz. Is this, uh, no, I don't think this is a dead base. I think any of the dead bases that are on here won't have any thralls around them. Because I did have DK turned on before we started the stream. But yeah, if you guys come across any dead bases, let me know in Discord. We'll get rid of them. And we totally missed grabbing the side again. You know what? Those guys usually kick my butt up there. So we're going to run over here and see if there's a T3 bearer before we're done. Or even another T2 bearer. A T2 bearer we got over here. He have a 750 alchemical base. That was a nice little surprise. I think that's the first time I ever got alchemical base off of any bearer under a T3 level. That'll heal up. Guess we better eat a little something. Yeah, we're good to go now. I'll probably be back on here later on tonight. Just do some more farming. Maybe a little more building. Probably make up some more uh, potions to reset the uh, my attributes. Probably go grab a grab a crap ton of uh, aloe plants. I'm hoping tomorrow or Friday we'll get Mr. Uh, Mr. Yuck over here. Do a little uh, Thanksgiving thing. A little fun little stream with him. Try to make it fun and interesting for you guys. Potent compost? Yeah, we'll take I think we've got enough already, but... Enrico, uh, that's what I thought. I swear it was a T2 that we killed here and we got 750 alchemical base out of them. I think it was just last week. Uh, I swear it was a T2 bear. That's why I was so surprised. But you're right, unless it's changed, you know, they changed the loot tables, it was never in a T2 or T1 uh, drop table. Doggo, you're back. Nothing. We went down to Hanneman's Grotto. Uh, Razakal was in there, and all we ended up getting were uh, Hanneman's gifts, potions. So I'm not going to cry about it. I mean, you get random attribute bonuses from them. Can I not, like, can I not, like, hit this guy or something? Ooh, another candle. Got to love our Sensi candles in here. I gotta get this axe repaired before it's broke, too. Yeah, Rico, I mean, it, it's it's highly possible that I saw it as a 2 and it was a 3, but I swear it was a, a T2 bearer. Those 
creepy guy's gonna follow us right in. Yeah, we're gonna shut the door and leave him outside with those guys. <laughs> See Hanneman's gift. We got five of those. We'll hang on to some of this. Why am I still carrying the prayer around? It's like not gonna do us any good. We'll keep it just in case. I don't know why. Doggro, nothing for you either out there, huh? Yeah, the Hanneman's gift is its kind of a letdown to get it instead of one of the monkeys or yetis, but still it gives you bonus attributes anyways. I mean, you get a little something anyways. What did we get out of this T1's pack? Stone and wood. Well, we'll take it and we'll throw it in there. Hardened brick down to 260. I definitely have to do some uh, farming today. But yeah, I'll be back on here later on. I'll be doing some farming. Maybe a little more building. Let's see what else? Oh, we can we can place our candle down. Woohoo! Another scentsy candle. Put it by the doorway there. Hey, lady, don't uh, don't step backwards. You're gonna burn your foot. Probably be on here a little later on today, doing some farming. Uh, like I said, just going and farming some uh, some more aloe stuff like that. Do a little more building later on. And then tomorrow, I don't know what we'll get into tomorrow. Maybe we'll start working on getting all of our uh, all of our pieces for our key. You got anything on you? Nah, you're good. We'll throw you back outside too. Yep, you look good standing right there, Dingus. I know you'll be in a totally different area tomorrow. These guys bring us anything good? Yeah, I'll eat your steak. I'll always take your steel. You know what? I'm going to take your resin too, just because I want it. And you don't need it. Ah, yeah, sure, Cheryl. If uh, you get purged, just holler out and chat. There's, uh, there's quite a few people on here be more than happy to help. I'll, I'll, uh, if I'm on, I'll definitely come down and give you a hand, too. Nope, wrong table. Put you in there. So how much steel fire do we have? I think we're set pretty good on steel fire for a little while now. We got a little bit of a stone consolidant going. Might make some more stone consolidate tonight, too. Yeah, we're still only a little more than halfway in our purge meter. We got time. And this little pot here. Go decorate our table by the uh, Wheel of Friendship over here. We don't have enough pots on there yet. How about right there? Oh, you know what? I wonder if uh, these the Watcher bookshelves are like... Oh, yeah. Nice, we can stack stuff on the Watcher bookshelves, too. Nicholasburg, how you doing? Yeah, anybody can join the server. Uh, any of the live streams, they have the server direct connect numbers for you on there. Uh, the server isn't showing up in the search list for some reason. I think it's because I had the server set to uh, test live branch for a while and it hasn't shown back up in the server list since I've changed it back. Might have to just uninstall everything, reinstall it, and then use the latest save file so that we're all back to where we are. Might have to do something crazy like that to get it to show up in the server list. 
but not today but yeah look in any of the descriptions under any of the live streams the uh the server direct connect numbers are in there so you can join it is a uh, pc though so you do have to be playing on pc because unfortunately there's no cross play but yeah i think that's where we're gonna end it i'll see you guys tomorrow about the same time hope everybody has a great day as always it's a lot of fun hanging out with you guys enjoy it every day stay safe stay careful